I'm Danielle. I'm Celeste. We are the co-founders of the Somatica Institute of Sex and Relationship Coaching. The Somatica Method is an experiential method that's both practical and vulnerably connected, and we help people have the most profoundly sexy and intimate relationships possible. We create a relationship lab in the room when clients are able to practice with the practitioner different aspects around relationship and sexuality, from emotional connection, uh, visiting the inner child, and developing sexual skills. Oh. Oh. Hi. Hi. Oh, so good to see you. Good to see you too. You look gorgeous. Thank you. <laughs> I feel pretty. <sighs> good. Well, have you had any reflections since we talked about a week ago, a week and a half ago? Um, I have to admit, not. Um, not too introspective. I was mostly worrying about clothes and makeup and hair. <laughs> <laughs> of course. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta look pretty. Yeah, so uh, I wanted it to kind of be whatever came up, you know, yeah. be real. So I didn't want to pre plan too much. Yeah, that makes a lot of sense. Mm -hmm. um, well, I feel like last time we talked about possibly exploring you really asking for what you want, not just during sex, but before, during, and after sex. Mm -hmm. Yes, does that sound right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and when I say that, what, what do you feel? Um, my heart rate goes up a little bit. Yeah. Yeah. You think it's fear? Um, I, yeah, I guess so, a little bit, yeah. Yeah. Do you know what you're scared of? Um, I guess putting out what I want, I guess, yeah. Yeah. It's really vulnerable to mm -hmm. put out what you want. Yeah. Because you don't know whether it's going to be received or fulfilled or rejected. Mm -hmm. or, yeah. Yeah. I think for today, what I, what I want you to get in your nervous system is an experience of well, as best as I possibly can, me listening and attuning and giving you what you want. Because I feel like that's foundational for you going and getting it out in the world, you know, to just be like, mm -hmm. oh, that can happen. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. And so I'm excited for you to be specific and picky. <laughs> ah. <laughs> Another <laughs> scary mm -hmm. word, mm -hmm. yes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And what what do you what is your reaction to picky? Mm. It's the um I don't want to be a good guest. I don't want to, you know. Hmm. Don't want to be picky. I just want to be able to um make it easy on the host or hostess or whatever. <laughs> like, yeah, that's fine. Or, yeah, um, I can eat that. <laughs> I wonder if we could switch it around in your mind mm -hmm. that this is actually not for me, this is for you. Like really for you, mm -hmm. not for anyone else around us or anywhere in the world. 100% mm -hmm. <laughs> for you. What happens in your body when I say that? Um, it's a little bit scary, but it feels pretty empowering. Yeah. I felt you like stop, but then mm -hmm. you did take it in. Mm -hmm. You must have been practicing. <laughs> <laughs> Every day of my life. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> Good work. Definitely my growing edge. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So maybe we can just imagine that you and I are, you know, I want to be, it doesn't have to be an imagination, I want to be your best lover. Okay. Okay. <laughs> and not just lover, but like um, 
partner, <laughs> you know, attachment mate, like, <laughs> right? Mm -hmm. Someone who you feel like, oh, she cares about me. She wants to give me what I want before, during, and after sex. It's not just about sex. It's about everything, sex and intimacy and love and connection. And you think, I think you know that I do want to give that to you. I do. And I want that for you more than anything. I do know that. Okay, good. <laughs> good. I feel that. Good. So maybe you could tell me, like, if I am going to connect with you for a first time, what, what do you want? What do you want me to say to you? How do you want me to touch you? Just anything that comes into um, your mind. And you don't have to think about it so much. You could actually like feel, here's how I would do it. I would take a deep breath. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Yeah, let's start there. Yes. <laughs> yeah. And feel that beautiful, enormous heart of yours because I know how big your heart is. And connect with your stomach. All the way down into your pussy. <sighs> and with that connection, when you open your eyes, don't open them yet, but when you open them, I want you to look at me. Mm -hmm. And I want you to just think, like, what do I want from her right now? What would make me feel the most connected? But think it with your, your pussy, your heart, your belly, okay? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Whenever you're ready. Mm. Oh, that's nice. You're looking at me like that. Mm. Lands well. Mm. I like looking at you. Mm. It's nice to hear. Um, I want to be closer to you somehow. Okay. Don't. We'll just try things and. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you want to go below? Okay. Yeah. And again, I don't want you to be okay. I want you to say, like, wait, no, this is what I really want. This mm -hmm. is what I really want in each move. Mm -hmm. Like, fine-tune it not towards getting by, but fine-tune it towards perfection. Exactly <laughs> what you want. Just exactly what you want. Yeah, so how's your hand? Where do you want your hand? I like Okay, good spot. Good. Your <laughs> okay, good. <That's> good. <laughs> Hmm. How's that? You're so pretty. You're so pretty. <laughs> hmm. I like that. Yeah. This is good. Mm -hmm. I want to be, um, careful of my hair because the curly like gets frizzy if you touch it too much but I like you touching my hair so I want to forget about worrying about the frizzy <laughs> 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 so you can keep touching my hair okay. Okay. Uh, I'll try to keep it intact <laughs> I'm glad you tell me you know it actually really helps because I think I can touch it and keep you looking just as gorgeous as you look right now <laughs> So nothing that you want is silly to me, just so you know. It's important to me. Mm. I don't think I'm worried about silly as much as um, putting somebody out or um, making them do something they're uncomfortable. Yeah, yeah. Well, I promise I will keep my boundaries, but I want you to make me work hard for you, okay? Oh, no, I don't know. If I yeah, I know, I know. I just try. I mean, I don't think it's going to feel hard inside of me, but I want you to really think like, 
I promise I'll, I'm not going to get resentful, not going to, you know, I will take good care of myself. Okay? Mm -hmm. I believe that. Okay. <laughs> Hmm. You touch my chest. Yes. Like, like. Like pressure. Yeah. It's almost a little too much too around my in throat. Your throat. Yeah. Widen yeah. your hand. Maybe like I don't worry about the mic. Is that better? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Just even taking the time between each step or ask is helpful. Yeah. So you can actually stay mm -hmm. in your body in the experience. Yeah. A minute to feel what I want next. Mm, take your time. Mm. I'm not going anywhere. Mm. Yes. <laughs> what next? <laughs> um, you, uh, talk to me like I don't know. Oh, good. Me. That's what I wanted to do. Oh, good. <laughs> because you, when you take me in like this, mm -hmm. and you really feel into what you want, mm -hmm. you get so soft and sexy and inviting. And I'm just like, you know, like melting into you. Right. <laughs> it just makes me want to do everything that you want. <laughs> well, <laughs> that's quite an invitation. <laughs> mm. Just looking at your face actually like is making my pussy tingle. Really? Yes. <laughs> Because you're so inside of good. yourself, you know? That's so beautiful. <clears throat> you mean like not spilling? Like self-possessed. Huh. Yeah. Mm. Look how good to hear. Like, it's how I want to be. Yeah, you're doing it right now. That's good. That's good. I'm good to hear that. Do you sense it? Like, does it feel different to you at all? Um, well, hearing the feedback that, that, I mean, I think I felt that before you said it, but yeah. to hear that that's actually how I'm presenting is good feedback. Yes. <laughs> good feedback. <laughs> hmm. Do you think I could get closer? I would love. Put my head on your shoulder. <clears throat> I feel very happy here, and I might not move. <laughs> mm -hmm. If you want to push it along a little bit, feel free. <laughs> well, <laughs> otherwise, do I'm... you want me to push it along? You don't have to. We don't have to get anywhere further than right here. Do you understand? There's no agenda except for your desire. When I hear from you that you um, like being close to me and you find me attractive and 
that my presence makes your pussy tingle. Mm. It makes me want to explore that further. Mm -hmm. But um, uh, I feel kind of low energy today, and I feel really, really comfortable with my head on your chest right now. Mm -hmm. so, well, what if you don't have to make anything happen, but I can keep like, you know, maybe like touching you and feeling mm -hmm. you up, but I know you can be like a hard worker, so you can just feel like, oh, mm. I can lay here and she'll just do things to me. <laughs> 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 and I don't have to do anything at all. Does that feel should I good? Ask, should I ask her that like that? Sure. I think practice saying that? Yes, good idea. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> um, mm. Celeste, mm. I want to just lay here, but I want you to feel free to um, try to arouse me or try to talk me into the next whatever. Ooh, I like that. <laughs> <laughs> yes. We're a good match. <laughs> <laughs> but I like it. I want you to understand I like it right now because I'm with you and I can feel your clarity, right? It's not like that's how I am in my sexuality necessarily. It's how I am with you right now because of how clear and self-possessed you're being. Does that make sense? I hear what you're saying, but it's hard to... I, I have a hard time... Um, associating the words clear with myself. Yeah, you're doing great. Thank you. You're doing great. Mm. Mm. Oh, I got another wave of turn on now. Did you? Mm. <laughs> when I deep breathe, you get turned on? Yep. <laughs> 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 I can feel it too. I can feel it deepening. I can feel my pussy getting warm too. And I'm just doing what feels good to me, but feel free at any point to give me feedback. Correct. Yeah, correct. <laughs> I like that too. I like a firm touch. Mm. I guess what I really like mm. is the um, juxtaposition of like a firm touch and a feather like touch. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. like being pressed up against the wall but having somebody touch your cheek really gently, mm. you know? Like that yes. is my favorite. <laughs> when you look away and then come back to my eyes too. Mm, I'll check out your beautiful body. Mm -hmm. <laughs> happening now. <laughs> I want them all to go away. <laughs> Indeed. <laughs> mm. 
Mm. That felt good. Mm -hmm. mm. Thank you. <laughs> Feels really good to me. I'm glad. I feel like a uh, like a Roman princess or something. Like I'm lounging yes. in my chase. <laughs> Good lounge. <laughs> you know what you deserve Feed to lounge. Feed me some grapes. Fan me with grapes. a palm frond. <laughs> I would peel those grapes for you. Oh, and feed them to me with your mouth. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> yeah, let yourself. Well, seriously, it feels so decadent. <laughs> it's beautiful. I love seeing you decadent. Right. Mm -hmm. That in my pussy for sure. Mm. <laughs> Good, lounge into it. <laughs> <laughs> You can just, <laughs> yes. <laughs> I love seeing you like this. Yeah. It's so beautiful. Thank you. You deserve it so much. Oh, tricky word for I me. I know, I know. <laughs> just, see, just see it in that same lounging goddess place <laughs> Cleopatra place yeah yeah you can see because Cleopatra deserves it Cleopatra I mean, deserves it and look at you you're Cleopatra <laughs> right now <laughs> there you are good Let's see if you can feel the deserving just for a second all the way down Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So sexy. Mm -hmm. You deserving <laughs> is so <laughs> sexy. Ah! <laughs> Makes me want to oh. eat you alive. Yes. <laughs> I consent. <laughs> So I promised that we would make sure that we checked in what you needed after. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Should we break and like sit up and uh, do that part? I don't know. I think maybe just even if we think about you trying. I want you to stay with Cleopatra. Okay. Okay. <laughs> like, yeah, because it's I have to be in that headspace. Yeah. To ask for what I want after, right? Yeah. I started thinking about something that had happened recently after and I was trying to translate it to this, but I don't know if I can. I think I need to just... To see what you want from me right yeah, now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, come back to your... Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Your oracles, your heart, <laughs> your belly, your pussy, mm -hmm. yes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And what would Cleopatra say after? Um, yeah, what do you need to know? about our connection, or how I feel about you, mm. or what kind of mm -hmm. touch do you need? Um, the touch is good. Um, I want to hear um, 
that you really enjoyed yourself. Mm, that's easy. <laughs> <laughs> and I want to hear you want to do it again. Mm. I loved so much getting to feel your softness and your Cleopatra self-possessedness. <laughs> And it makes me just want to dive into you, like I said, and mm -hmm. eat you alive. <laughs> and to do it over and over and over again. Mm -hmm. You can't wait till next time. I can't wait till next time. <laughs> <laughs> yes. I can't wait till next time. I'm still lounging a little bit. Still. No. I don't think you should ever <laughs> stop lounging. This should be the new normal. What do you think? Try that. Why Maybe not? Hard in the car and the drive home. <laughs> just kick back. <laughs> just, mm. <laughs> yes. Because <laughs> so I can, you know, you're so inviting. I feel like so much will come to you mm. if you're just there like this. Mm -hmm. This beautiful queen. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. One last breath into it so okay. that it sticks and stays <laughs> okay. with you. Hold my hand yes. during it. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Mm. God, you're beautiful. Mm. You are too. Mm. Okay, I'm going to send you on your Cleopatra way. Okay. okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love you, honey. Still very queenly. <laughs> queenly. I know. Should we just call you Cleopatra? <laughs> yes, please. <laughs> queenly. Yeah. And you made a little gesture to your heart there. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I just um, feel very like it's possessed. I feel just very in my body and of myself. Mm -hmm. What did you learn about yourself? Um, that I like giving direction. <laughs> You're very good. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> well, I mean, I guess I do that in my everyday life. You know, as mom, you're always telling people what to do all day, but never in service of me, right? Mm. So. Yeah, there was something really beautiful you said about um, not fine tuning, you know, just, I think it was just to get it okay, but mm -hmm. to really get it just right mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. for you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What do you think, like, how are you going to take this experience out there? Like, what do you, what do you imagine you can, you can take away from this? Um, I'll definitely have Celeste's voice in my head about, you know, being Cleopatra out there in the world. Like, I should just take on lounging as my every day. <laughs> I love the vision of you yeah. in your car. Just <laughs> <laughs> in the pickup line. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like... I'm adding some decadence to my everyday life, I think. Mm -hmm. And um, what she spoke to me about um, when I'm soft and open, I just invite things in, and um, that speaks to my worldview. So I think mm -hmm. to just keep that in mind, that if I'm soft and open, what I need will come to me. Mm -hmm. um, I want to keep that in the forefront of my mind. That's beautiful. <laughs> Anything else about your experience that you want to share or say out loud so it can you can also take it away um it it was a nice experience i'm uh, sexually i'm very submissive and i 
go with the flow and I like being told what to do and where to stand and all that kind of thing. So it was um, nice to see that I could be turned on the other way, be turned on telling somebody what to do and where to put their hands and how to touch me. And um, I did get turned on by that. And so it was nice to experience and something I'll want to play with a little bit more yeah. too. So you're a little, you're multifaceted in your Switch. arousal profile. <laughs> <laughs> Love it. <laughs> great session huh yeah I feel like we've known Sabrina for a long time and you know I can relate to some of her wounds because I'm also anxious and I'm a hard worker she's such a hard worker mm -hmm. she is. she's such a hard, she's worker. Such a hard worker <laughs> and she got four kids you know and she's just giving 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 to everyone all the time and I think also in romantic experiences like that's how she orients and so I wanted to help her like learn how to just lie back and receive and ask for everything that she wants. And when she like got into her Cleopatra, she was so sexy. She was, it was so graceful to see her there. She yeah. like really, she, you could like paint her. I know. <laughs> <laughs> like, oh, I'm so relaxed. <laughs> she, was, she owned it. And, and I know for myself, the more I get into that feeling the more um, yeah the more empowered and self-possessed mm -hmm. and I do feel like people come to me more and I, I want that for her so badly too and I just saw all of her potential realized in that moment you know so totally it was really really yeah. nice it was really beautiful to show her to see her like step into it yeah. because I think she so much feel like she doesn't deserve it and it's not something that she's supposed to have and I think part of her submissive is also to relax from all the decisions to make she needs to make, but also like not to bother anyone with what she wants. And yeah. I think her wanting is so sexy. Yeah, I want it for all the women yeah, <laughs> on yeah. the planet. Me too. <laughs> <laughs> and I think that could work with her submissiveness too. She totally. could just say like, "Oh, I, now I want you to take over," but she doesn't ever have to feel like she has to work hard. Exactly. You know? That's my dream for her. Yeah, yeah. totally. Mm. Yeah. Cheers to Sabrina. Yes, <laughs> such a <oddie>. mm. <laughs> <sighs> I'm trying.